So Happy Death Day tells the story of a college girl who's being hunted by a killer, but every time she dies, the day keeps resetting, and in order to break the time loop, she needs to figure out who the killer is and needs to stop him. This movie is not that bad. Some things go about it, about it could have been better, but not that bad. Let's get into the number one thing I hate about this movie. The killer reveal. It's Tree's roommate. The reason why she does it is over a guy that she likes buzz into Tree more than her. Really? That's the best you can come up with. Well, writers and directors, f you. Sorry, I lost my cool because it just pissed me off that that's what they went with. That's basically my main issue with the movie is the killer reveal because that straight up was stupid. Let's get into some things I loved about the movie. Everything else I loved about the movie. The characters, except for a couple. Tree, the guy she was on the day at the end by the end of this movie. Can't remember his name. Oh, well, screw it. The time loop. I thought that was pretty interesting because it's never done that in a horror movie before as far as I know. And it was pretty fun to watch that, actually. It was really fun to watch all that. Maybe in that little montage of Tree dying over and over and over, but it was really fun to watch all that. And I like how she actually remembers her being killed and the day restarting because that's kind of... They kind of have to do it, otherwise the movie would just be the same thing over and over again, which would be stupid. But this was a really enjoyable movie. The acting in some things, not that bad. Tree, but lady, the actress who plays Tree did good. Everyone else did okay, not great acting. I've seen some pretty damn good acting in my life. But in this movie, yeah. I like how she's different every, in the time loops. Every, in every time the day resets, she's different. She's a different person because in the beginning, she's just this mean girl who's mean to everyone, her roommate, the guy that was in her dorm, everybody. Like everybody. And then throughout the movie, she becomes more and more of a good person. And my favorite scene in this movie is when she's having dinner with her, her well, birthday lunch with her father. That was really emotional, and the reason why she doesn't talk to him that much on her birthday is because her mother and her shared the same birthday, and she died. So, yeah, that's pretty sad. So, yeah, that was my, like, a good scene. It shows, it makes emotions come out of me that make me feel sad. Everything else about, the, another thing I actually didn't like about the movie is this pointless, there was a lot of pointless stuff in the little montage and one thing that annoyed me in the montage was when she was going out to one of her friends who she was the killer and just because she got hit by a buzz she thought she wasn't the killer just because you got hit by a buzz and the both of you died doesn't mean that she's not the killer i'm just saying just saying but i will give happy death day three stars out of five join me soon as i review its sequel happy death day to you real soon so, till then guys, I'll see you later.